I'm David. I'm the director of data science and a senior OD consultant here at DecisionWise. Today, I wanted to talk about how we treat the confidentiality of our survey participants. One of the questions we get asked about frequently is, how secure are my answers? And so I wanted to take a couple of minutes and talk about how we treat your results. To do that, we need to go over why are we even doing this survey? Ultimately, the whole point of an engagement survey is because no matter where you are as an organization, whether you're top 10 on everyone's list or whether you literally just had a knife fight break out in the kitchen, every company can get better. And increasing engagement is one of the best ways to do that. We take the results you provide and create an action plan to help improve your work environment. We call it the engagement campaign. So it goes without saying, first off, please participate. We're going to create an action plan either way, so you might as well have your voice included in it, right? And second, please be honest. The more honest you are, either positively or negatively, the more valid the survey becomes and the better the subsequent engagement campaign will turn out. Now, this honesty part gets tricky. What if you, for example, don't really like a particular aspect of your job or your supervisor or your team? If you're honest, couldn't that put you in danger of retribution or some other negative consequence? I'd love to tell you that would never happen, but the unfortunate truth is that sometimes human nature is to react defensively when faced with harsh truths. And so, as big a believer as I am in honest, open communication, sometimes the smartest decision might be just to not say anything at all. But if you do that, how will things ever get better? If you have no hope that your job can improve, what do you think that does to your engagement? And you're right, it, it definitely doesn't go up. So the solution then is to figure out a way where you can still feel safe communicating vulnerable thoughts and feelings, and that's where we come in. As a third party, DecisionWise is in a position where we can collect your data and report it back in a way that your organization will never even have a chance to see who said what. We keep all your data strictly confidential. Everything is done through our secure website and server, and the raw data are automated so no one ever even sees it. Then, when we report the data back, it's kept strictly at the aggregate level. No individual responses are ever used or even seen. We have some demographics on the back end that allow us to filter by things like organizational structure, gender, location, etc. But even then, if there aren't enough people in a particular demographic to protect confidentiality, the report simply spits out insufficient data. So why even collect demographics? Well, it goes back to the whole point of the survey in the first place, to make things better for you. Demographics do that in two ways. First, not every employee is having the same experience. And so we shouldn't treat, for example, new employees the same way we treat people with 20 plus years of tenure. Thus, we can tailor the engagement campaign to better suit different groups of people. Second, human nature again, sometimes we'll come across managers that just dismiss the results out of hand saying, oh, these don't apply to me for whatever reason. When we can filter by division or location and show that they do apply, leaders are better held accountable. Remember, we've been in this business for over 20 years. We've seen it all and we're really good at what we do. Our business model is founded on being careful with your data. If we ever gave someone a reason to not trust us, word would get out and business would dry up in a heartbeat. We want to protect your data as much as you do. Now, one word of advice, in the comments section, if you don't want to reveal who you are, then don't say anything revealing, like if you've complained 20 times that you need a new coffee maker in the break room, and then in the comments you say, no one listens to me that we need a new coffee maker in the break room, well, then it's obvious who made that comment. But rest assured, even in that case, all your quantitative data were thrown into a big pool and aggregated, so there would be no way to tie a comment to anything else in the survey. Confidentiality is our promise to you in return for you providing honest answers. Remember, the survey and subsequent engagement campaign are only as good as the data we put in. So I encourage you to participate and answer truthfully. We'll do our part and make sure the results get turned into feedback that can be used to make your job, well, more engaging. <laughs>